While many health care workers are on the front lines in the battle against the virus, hospitals like St. Al's are struggling financially. This means some of their employees will be taking pay cuts. The news announced to employees through a letter by the CEO saying these are not, quote, normal times and the loss of volume and increased costs with preparing for COVID-19 is more than their revenue. Their revenues have declined anywhere from 50 to 80 percent, she says. In order to keep going, the hospital is making some changes. Administrators and senior leaders taking anywhere from 15 to a 25 percent pay cut. Some employees will be reduced to part time and those who have significantly less work because of the coronavirus could be furloughed. A spokesperson for the hospital tells us they are still evaluating how to use everyone. For example, someone who works in an area where elective procedures have stopped could be moved to work in other areas instead of having their hours reduced. And they're also still looking at when these changes will take place and how long they will be in effect.